Hey Shawnees, to address your question on the waist measurement being different than the pattern measurements, pattern measurement front and back being 42 inches, and then the body measurements being 28 inches. What's happening is the bottom measurements are exactly what that is. They're the body measurements. If you were to take a measuring tape, measure your bust, waist, and hip, according to the pattern, they're saying anybody with these particular measurements, they recommend that they cut to size 14, which is fine. So the difference that you're noticing between the waist measurement and the pattern has to do with this elastic waist. What they're doing is they're adding extra fabric to accommodate the gathers here. When you add your elastic, it draws it in and you'll have the blousing effect. Down here on view C and D, which are the tunic views, the 42 inch that you're getting accommodates the hips. So we have to make a garment at least wide enough to accommodate the hips. Since the tunics come below the hips, the garment has to be able to fit. So when you have a tunic, it's kind of a boxy shape, a little square, and then it A's out to skim past the hips. According to this pattern paper or this pattern envelope, the person's hip that wears a size 14 is a 38. So the difference between 38 and 42 not a big difference. So we are able to get this on and around the hips. So that's the reason why the waist is at 42 inches because the waist actually slims down, it comes down. It's more like a boxy view. So that 42 inches comes all the way down to the hips. It may grade out a little bit as well. Um, I didn't check the finished garment measurements. Um, actually, it's not on here. So... Anyway, um, to reiterate, that 42 inches of common is there for the ease, the wearing ease when you add your elastic and the blouse soon effect. And then for, and that's for A and B. And then for C and D, same thing, but it accommodates the hips. There's a little bit of gathering here in the back of the yoke to take some of the fullness out the back. And that's also just a design ease, uh, it takes some of the fullness out the back so the back's not hanging and not so puffy and it allows it to fit the yoke as well. So that's just a, um, a way to take some of that extra fabric out. But if you put a belt on, you'd have the same effect as here. But this is a loose fitting garment. It's not supposed to fit so close to the body. So that's how come the numbers are so big. So I hope this clears up your questions and any speculation you had about this pattern. Also, too, real quick, I just wanted to show you how it fits the model so you can understand what I was saying. You see the extra ease and the extra room here, but then it skims her hips. Okay? And that's for the tunic view. And then the extra ease is accommodated with the elastic. Hope this helps.